Hey everyone, welcome back to uh, The Long Dark with Dylan and Dave. This is episode 11. Uh, we're trying to recover from the bear apocalypse by moving on to the next zone. Uh, we spent several minutes paring down our inventory. We can run, but it's not going to be very good. Uh, we got rid of all of our worst food, repaired what we could, and we're heading out. And uh, any, uh, any weirdness in this game was probably explained by the fact that it has patched like twice since the last time we've played. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of the nature of, of Let's Plays. We try to do a, a couple episodes in a sitting. But, you know, sometimes the things happen. Like, you do ten episodes in a sitting. Well, this is also an early access game, which is going to make that even more prone to happening. But yeah, uh, so okay. So since last, <coughs> time, since last time we played, um, they put in a new zone... And several new items, so I'm sure we're going to run into some stuff we have no idea what the hell it is. Uh, that should make it fun, right? It should, hopefully. Uh, right now we're heading to the Coastal Highway as the next zone, so that means we need to go through a coal mine in the northeast of this map. Hopefully we can find more sweet coal. Yeah, we will. That stuff burns forever. That's great. I bet you... So there's supposed to be a forge somewhere in the game. I bet you it's, I bet you it's in the Coastal Highway. Um, I could look. I mean, you could, but I don't know. I bet it's actually not in the coastal highway. I bet it is, uh... Uh-oh. We got a wild Dela. She's appearing. You hear her? Oh, yeah. God. I don't know how high her microphone gain is today. You might be able to. <laughs> What's up, wild Dela? It's too windy outside. You're a windy outside. We're recording now. It's okay. I just wanted to hand it. I'm sorry, babe. Well, anyway, that was my wife. Um, you guys know her from uh, Walking Dead. We're going to start uh, doing Wolf Among Us soon, so you should check that out. Anyway, back to back to Long Dark and our awesome walking escapade. Canadian walking simulator. Uh, we think we have everything we're going to need. I didn't. I think the only thing we don't have is a piece of wood. There we go thinking again. Um, because I figured, you know, we're... We have a hatchet, and we're going into the wilderness, so we should be okay on wood. Uh, if this bridge doesn't collapse on me. Dave's over there, like, fucking trying to navigate. Well, you were asking me where the, uh, where's, uh, where's the forge at? I wasn't asking that. I said, it's probably there. Jeez, Dave. Right, which, which, which means we gotta figure out if you're right or not. Why? I don't know. Dave's me. Just do. Oh man, we got some serious uh, Canadian walking here. Good old Canadian walking. Joaquin Phoenix. So there is. If you want to do me an actual research favor, an you actual should, research favor, yeah, you should uh, you should check to see if there can be wolves in the coal mine. I can't find a map of the coal mine. I don't think there can be wolves in the coal mine though. I think the only indoor wolf is our buddy in the. Uh, Dam. Our buddy in the DM, yeah. Oh, wolf apocalypse. We might have lost some footage between uh, Bear Apocalypse and now. You guys didn't miss anything. Uh, we were just getting our stuff together in the house. It, it took a while. It would have been boring to film. Yeah, and making sure our dude wasn't at 1% durability anymore. It seriously, it took a long time to get our shit together. Uh... It did. It was kind of a mess. We're leaving behind a sizable horde of bullshit. Yeah, there's a... If everything goes according to plan, there is another... It's like the top level area in the game. It's the new zone. It's, the, uh, it's the newest zone. Yeah, there's actually two new zones that we haven't I'm seen. I'm calling yet. it the Matterhorn. Yeah, we're, we're heading towards Coastal Point and then Desolation, whatever. Or Coastal Highway. Coastal Desolation. Highway, Desolation Point. And then we're going to go back back towards here to hit the mountain. And where we will probably die in an unfortunate mountain climbing accident. Probably. Uh, I'm surprised we haven't already. By the way, that's in the game now. Rope climbing. Yeah. And apparently it's super dangerous. Really? Yes. Oh, did you look it up? Yeah, I read about it in the patch notes and some, oh, great, some stuff like that. It's ruin, ruin the air. You know, surprise. Uh, I'm sorry, I looked at the patch notes on Steam. You looked at the patch notes? Yeah. Spoilers! Hey, hey, remember what happened over at that farmhouse? I do. Apocalypse. Or Bear Apocalypse. Something Apocalypse. <coughs> you want to go see if the bear's back? Well, I do have a thirst for vengeance. 
Uh, they made it so that um, fences, unless they're solid, don't stop wind anymore. Well, that's probably... Dave, please thing. don't eat your rice with your fingers. Dylan, thank you for just embarrassing me on video, Jesus. Well, it's audio. Dave's over there eating again. I picked up one clump of rice with my fingers and now I'm a barbarian. Well, I mean, it is covered in goo. Yeah, well, you know, that's what happens when you cook okra with it. Huh. Also, it's quieter than using a fork. I was trying to respect our viewers. Shut up, Dave. But thank you for You're already just... eating during the video. <laughs> no one knew until you said that. I did. You, of course you knew. You're sitting next to me. Touche. Touche, Dave. Everyone else is going to be, oh, Dave, you can't be eating dinner during videos. Shut up, Dave. It's basically my job to make inappropriate noises during videos. I know. That's like your that's like your addition to the to the cause, right? Yeah, eat food, play with handguns, bang shit around, knock stuff over. So we got our first comment on a video. <laughs> it was basically Hold on, hold on, hold on. Dave, why don't you pull it up and read it? So <clears throat> so that you don't get this wrong and make us feel bad. Oh, I I implying I can feel bad. I can feel bad, Dave. I can feel bad. <laughs> we probably shouldn't be calling one of our 12 subscribers out. Whoa. Although, did you look? Is this guy actually subscribed? Or did I you have just... no idea. Didn't even pay attention. Oh, my God. Dylan. You're trying to be mean to people on the internet. And you're not making But he watched easy. our last video, so maybe he'll watch this one and feel bad about it <laughs> also. You should probably turn your volume off. I was going to say, now check this out. My computer's not <laughs> muted, so you're going to hear episode 10 on episode 11. Oh, man, Inception. Um, so we're freezing. I don't know how. I mean, it's got to be pretty cold before we... we didn't so, start. In all fairness, I think this guy is trying to be helpful. But it also kind of comes off as, like, stealth promoting his own video. Oh, he wrote four? Yeah, he wrote us a book. Oh, I only saw the first one. He actually, he technically wrote five. Damn. Yeah, yeah, this guy wrote us a book. And do, do, I'm not going to look his stuff up. Dude's at 2640, you shot the bear, and now it's time to duck into the tractor and wait for it to die, or spark up a torch, which prevent bear attack. Watch my bear hunting tips. I don't know. At 3145, you wasted your wood. A fire is not possible out in the open and windy weather, which is in all fairness true, but we were also trying not to end the playthrough. Could have built your fire on the lee side of the tractor where the wind was blocked and then snooze in the tractor. Of course, the wind will shift, but that's to be expected. You can drop them. Excuse me. You can drop all the excess tools, hatchets, while you head back to the reed moor. Farmhouse to recover your conditions. You will probably need the food there. Well, guess what? We didn't need the food there. We had plenty in the uh, in the shed. Check this Barn. out. Yeah, check it out. I forget, do you run faster if you don't have the rifle out? I'm not sure. Also, we're not trying to min-max this playthrough, so, uh, yeah. Yeah. Now, what is news to me is that the bear actually apparently would have bled out, and we could have went and found his stuff somewhere. Really? Yeah, that, that's what, uh, that's what Comments Guy claims. Um, well, I mean, he, in all honesty, he does know what's going on, obviously. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he's clearly more hardcore about this game than we are. Uh, and we're not saying he's, and, you know, mean Yeah, or we're, we're not we're saying just, you're a bad guy. Uh, I think we're playing it differently. Comment guy. We're just... Uh, we're definitely playing it differently. We're, we're definitely, yeah, we're, we're not as serious about this game as you are. And, I mean, and, shit, I, I barely even... And, what, and I'm sorry, but saying watch my bear hunting tips just gives me way too many opportunities to be a dick to pass up. There was just some cola in there and stuff. Okay. Um, so you're down here. Uh, yeah. So... I guess I could take a second and warm up, couldn't I? Yeah. And if you, uh... Just some more garbage food. You're yeah, garbage! I'm supposed to check registers for arrowheads. Yeah, apparently arrowheads are no longer craftable for metal. You've got to, uh... Find them. Find them now. Which kind of sucks, but... Damn it. Damn you, Herbal Tea. So I don't really know... Lantern fuel? Take it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we're going into a mine, I guess. Mm -hmm. Tinder plug. We forgot the pry bar. It's less forget, more. Didn't give a fuck. More couldn't couldn't hold. Find some more jerky. Cool. Uh, yeah. 
I don't know why we're so cold. It must be just a chilly day in Canada land. So I think we're going across the big bridge now. Yep. Uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, if you if you want to see like a professional play this game, you can you can go watch that guy. He seems seems pretty knowledgeable. Um, he also wasn't like mean to us, so that's cool. I pretty much had to give that guy a shout out though, because he was first. Man, it's pretty Canada out here today. You said it, girl. So I guess we don't really need to check all this shit, do we? I mean, we're, we're doing pretty well on this shit. I'd like a pry bar, but the chances of finding one are pretty low. Yeah, this guy this guy does a pretty serious long dark playthrough. Wood matches? Uh, cool. He is much more pro at this game than we are. Dave, it's not how pro you are. It's how good your commentary is. That's true, we're probably more interesting. Ha 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 ha. Nah, he's, he's probably more interesting. <laughs> nah, there's two of us and only one of him. We get twice as many chances to be interesting. Oh man, are you now, excited for me to post that now, first? Uh, our per capita interesting might be lower. Yeah. Are you are you excited for me to post that first Space Marine video? That was a good video. That's gonna. You, you need to watch our Space Marine playthrough if you're a person who's alive and listens to YouTube videos because it's it's gonna be great. Yeah, that's got uh, us both, and then it's got Andrew from our group too. Uh, he had never heard of uh, Warhammer somehow, and so we uh, introduced him. I'm not gonna check all the shit. We don't need it. Pretty sure Andrew actually lives like under a log. Um. Well, he has sat a lot. I don't even know what I'm looking for at this point. I've never not needed stuff in this game. Are you hunting the booty? Painkillers? <coughs> they weigh like nothing. I mean. Yeah, but the whole po the whole problem is that everything weighs like nothing until you get all of it. <laughs> so, Turns out, like nothing is not quite the same as nothing. That's true. Do we have, like, max level undershirt yet, or...? Uh, we don't have wool long underwear. I think that's the thing. We have cotton long underwear. I'm not taking most of this stuff, by the way. Well, I was just wondering, I could I can never remember if the ugly deer sweater is innerwear or outerwear. Oh, fleece? Yeah. It's a jacket, I believe. It's outerwear. Oh, okay. Um... So we did some math. Energy bars. Number one food. It's like they're bars of energy or something. Yeah, thank you, science. I think MREs are technically better, but... Are they? Yeah. I mean, well, I mean, they're an MRE. They're like an energy bar package. <laughs> it's like a bar of energy bars. Okay, so I just go... Until there's no more uh, mountains on the right, right? Right. Cool. Oh, let me go ahead and sprint. I'm using finger quotes. You guys can't see it, but I can. Apparently it's a rabbit spawn up here, so maybe we could test our bow out. We only have one arrow. That's a good point. <laughs> you think we should like wait till a sure thing, or I'd rather save it with, for an emergency. Let's shoot one with a flare gun. We don't have a flare gun. Not yet. Now, if you shot a bear in the mouth with a flare gun, would it die? I don't know. Science, Dave. Science. We're getting a little tired. Or somebody's watching us. We never did learn that icon. No, we finally figured it out. It's us getting tired. And seriously, though, guy who uh, guy who promotes uh, promotes his own long dark playthroughs, you're great. We were probably being a little bit of a dick to you earlier. We appreciate all of our viewers, even if they do have their own videos. Even if they are better, at, <laughs> better than us. Yeah, even if they are better than us <laughs> in video games. Oh, uh, he was probably just checking out competition. Uh, and he might be. He stumbled into the wrong kind of competition. <laughs> He'll see that if he watches uh, Jacoby and I's Civilization 5 playthrough. <laughs> Where we take back the country from the white man. Uh, how tired are we, all on? In real life? Very game. game. We're very tired, actually. Mm. Um, that's not good. I guess we can sleep when we get in the cave, can't we? 
Or is there yeah. a house or anything? No, we we passed the last good house. Um, do we bring a cup of coffee with us? We could stop and brew a cup of coffee. We have to get some wood first. We'll just we'll take a nap when we get to the mine. Oh, hey, you and Dale should go to the dollar store and give me rivets when you go out. What? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going to the movies later, right? Yeah, we're going. We're going to go see that Deadpool movie. Yeah, well, you should. Uh, you should go to Dollar Tree and get rippets. I hope this is the right way, Dave. It looks like a path, and... And on the map, it also looks like a path, so... I mean, they've got similarities. <laughs> this is exactly like navigating with Dylan in real life. Except I know everything. Yeah. Everything. Are you sure we're going the right way? Now, if you guys have Dollar Trees wherever you live, I will say they have good gummies there for a dollar. They also have good energy drinks for a dollar. Although, uh, if you're a veteran, they might give you war flashbacks. Oh my god. Well, I'm just saying. Yeah, I, I didn't like them that much, Dave. I liked I, I liked Rippets pretty well. They, they sound like... They sound, they sound like, like a drug. Yeah. yeah. They, they sound like we're huffing whipped cream chargers, but I swear we're not right now. I swear. Now, they said that they made the, the inside of the caves and mines more... Um, more linked to the outside temperature of either end, depending on which one you're closer to. So, it's going to be cold. Well, that is literally contrary to 100% of how mines work, but... Dave, it's because the air blows into it every once in a while, okay? Right, so like, you know, there's this stuff called the Earth, and it, uh... You mean the Earth. The Earth. And the Earth is insulative. And, uh... Welcome to Earth. What? I didn't do anything. <laughs> are we gonna have a Are we gonna have a replay of the of the hunting experience? Uh, I read a, I read some patch notes. Did you know that there was actually a bug that made, made iron sights not as accurate as they should be? Boom! I absolutely believe that because the gun has basically been like throwing bullets in this game. I throw them. I throw them back first, so they explode everywhere. So I don't work. think that's how any of those things work. Should I, should I grab a branch while we're here? You should, because if we want to start a coal fire, we're going to need something else to start. We need first. something to start the coal. Can we burn sticks? Yeah, we can burn sticks. Mm -hmm. How many sticks do you think we'll need? 60. Okay, well, we can get like 6. I think we need between 5 and 10, so that might be enough. That was 6. Okay. I think we have to go up here. It looks like it on the yeah, map. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, sure you're, I'm sure you're right. Dude, you remember like the first couple episodes when we, were, when, we were, when we weren't using the map? Yeah, that was a mistake. Especially that, I don't remember what episode it was, but we just got lost. It was like <laughs> seven or eight, which is why we started using the map. It's just like, oh lord. Oh lord. We were lost in several of the earlier episodes, it just wasn't as evident. Yeah, we played our cool... Played. I got my my tasty cherry beverage that I don't want to mention because they're not paying me. It's it's not Dr Pepper. I was just kidding. Were you there uh, down at the lake when Buddy decided he was going to start calling Dr Pepper number twenty three? Yeah, it's got twenty three flavors, man. Ever calls right? That. Yeah. Right. <laughs> uh, you and you and Buddy apparently. Question. On the map, right Answer, before maybe. the mine, what the fuck is that thing? That means there's some old man's beard. Oh, like that right there? Yeah, like that. I don't need it though, right? We no, have shell bandages. Yeah. Well, the old man's beard doesn't make a bandage; it makes the bandage better. You make a bandage better because it was like stops the bleeding quicker. Oh, because it gets in there and grows. <laughs> right. Wait, what? <laughs> it's got soothing action. Soothing action. action, action. How's your food, Dave? It's good. What'd you have? I had uh, deer meat and okra and rice. Okra, huh? Yep. So you like gross shit, huh? I like okra. Or like gross, bro. Ready? Ready! You guys ready? Immediately die to a wolf. <coughs> or some sort of yeti. A yeti wolf? Basic wolf scarf. 
They just kind of give a shit when we get in here. <laughs> yes, they do. Uh, so we're tired. How cold is it in here? Feels like 58. Want to go ahead and take a nap? Yeah. Eat, drink, take a nap? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take a nap, eat, and drink. Uh, nap first, because we're t most tired. Yeah. Oh, please be no Yetis. <laughs> that would be the best stealth patch ever. Well, I watched that... Uh, what game was that? Shit. I watched a game on the thing before dawn. Yeah, before dawn. And uh, now that game has a twist. I don't know if you guys know it. I don't really want to ruin it. But it's Windigos. <laughs> yeah. I know what game you're talking about, but I don't think it's called that. Before Dawn? Yeah. You got the Google. Get to it. I'm trying to, like, pay attention to our video. I'm eating energy bars, Dave. Did you put that over with our other dishes, or, or would you have to move? Well, I'll probably have to move. <laughs> oh, yeah. Living the life. Okay, so... How much coal? Oh, fuck. Three? I don't know. Huh. Let's smash the container open and make sure we got it all. Well, we also need something to start the fire. Because all true. we got some sticks. Um, yeah. So, shall we? We're actually yeah. moving a lot better now. Let me make sure we're doing okay. Still a little tired, but we'll sleep on the end of the uh, other end of the cave. Sounds good. Sounds good. How much uh, coal are we going to try to pick up? As much as we can. This stuff's amazing. This is kind of a cool little environment. How many wolves do you think there are in here? Like 15? 40. Oh, a couple of bear overlords? Oh, fuck me. Left or right, Dave? Um, Since we can't find a... I'm going right. Yeah, I can't find a map of this area, but it looks like it shouldn't matter. It just kind of can put us out at... Uh, Two different spots? Yeah. Oh, this is awesome. Look at this, Dave. We need to get over there. You take the left, yeah. Hmm. I want those bullets, though. Uh, maybe we loops around? Uh, no, it's not connected on that side either. Oh! Ooh, fuck. Were we within grab range? No. Now we're probably stuck. No, dude, there's a ramp. We can go back up. I like the sound that Cole makes. It's like... You sure we can't walk up that uh, stack of rocks? Nah. Oh, shit. I would, it's okay. <clears throat> it's hey, only... can we walk up the, the, the timber in the middle there? What timber in the middle? Right, right there. That, yeah, that takes us back to the one we were on. Oh. And that one's blocked, so we can't use that one. Eh, fuck it. It's okay. There's just a few bullets. Yeah, bullets are kind of a big deal. <laughs> Not as big as 50 pounds of coal. That's a tough decision, actually. Not sure if I'd rather have the bullets. We're going to get so lost. I don't think you can get lost that bad. I think this is pretty linear of an area. I'm going to make a fire at the other end, which is why I'm picking up all this bullshit. Yeah. How's it linear? It had, like, at least two different ways to go. Yeah, but I think it's... I think they're just a big... Workbench. Horseshoe. Beefy jerk. Kind of surprised we're not slowing down right now. What about you? A little bit... Work boots back. Oh. oh, I forgot to check the drawer on the uh, okay. workbench. Come on, everywhere. Come on. Stacy's grape soda. What? We don't need to repair anything or make anything. We've got tenant plugs, so. 
Oh, we can eat and drink though, because I just picked up. Just picked so up beef jerky and a pop. Yeah, beef jerky and a pop. Boom! Exa exactly twenty five hundred calories. Damn. Because I used that whole soda. Man, I've been playing that XCOM 2 lately. Oh man. XCOM 2 legit to quit? It is too legit to quit. The game. Dolan's actually been fired from his job over XCOM 2. Well, you know, there's worse things to get fired over, Dave. <coughs> like XCOM 1 since that came out a long time ago. <laughs> or you mean XCOM US UFO Defense? Well, there's that one too. Shit. Nope, okay, this is different. You were thinking that that was the same one I thought it was. No, I was thinking that, uh, I was wondering if maybe this area wasn't as linear as I thought it was, and I was thinking of a different mine area. Yeah, there's gonna be so many fucking windigos in here. <laughs> I, I don't know what kind of mining they're doing down here, but they probably shouldn't <laughs> just have painkillers. <laughs> well, there's already just, like, fucking coal all over the floor, so... Maybe they're doing that kind of mining where they don't really give a shit. They just kind of. Why do they have bullets? Just kind of smash a hole and throw it on the ground and. Oh, good. Oh, good. Don't need that. Don't need that. Ah, uh, now we're starting to slow down. Left or right, Dave? Uh, I think left, but I doubt it matters. Nah, <laughs> you're funny. Funny guy. Probably the funniest. I mean, you are the wiener. Left or right? Left or right? This left. Is the way. Left? Okay. I'm not picking up any more coal. We've already got like 50. Yeah. I mean, you know. We're trying to get outside, so obviously we want to go up instead of down. No, dude. We're dwarves. This is looking promising, Dave. That this is probably the start of the history we're at. <laughs> Oh, poor John. Oh, dude. Building in a building so you can shit while you shit. Think of the insulation, Dave. Think of the me. insulation. Uh, it's, a, it's a plastic port John. There's probably not that much insulation. Uh, oh, that's 100%. Yeah. Let's drop the other one. Well, oh, is the other one less? No. We're, we're taking oh. them both. Okay. Come on, dude. Oh, cut. Did you could yeah, let you open it, didn't there? Or was that you taking no, the, was... turning the thing off? Yeah, it won't let me open the do cut. <laughs> Fucking do cut. <laughs> no fapping. I'm just disappointed that we don't see porta potties in real life uh, often. often enough for calling them do cuts to be really cemented in our mind. Okay, so we got a couple hours before dark. Do we want to leave the mine? Um. So, here's what our way out's looking like. Looks like if we go left, we're in danger of wolf, wolf attack, but we also get to a pretty good area. And if we go right, it takes us right to a trailer. So. Uh, let's see where we come out, shall we? Well, I know we might come out there. Don't, don't, don't look at me like that. As as far as I know, the only exit. Boom. How are we doing on time, Dave? Uh, we're right at half an hour. Okay. So let's find a place to put up for the night. Do you want to go left? We got rifle. I mean, I think we'll be fine. Yeah, go left. Just watch out for wolves. You, you want to take a left, right? Right. I see it. Because that's the right. E. Also, trailer. <laughs> Who wants to live in one of those, right? I'm not bubbles. Or he lives in like a shed, doesn't he? <laughs> yeah, you. Believe you lived under Ricky's porch for a while. <laughs> Oh, I've never even seen that show. <laughs> You've seen a couple episodes of it. Yeah, like one. Dale just hates it, so we don't get to watch it. But it's it's good. They're Canadian, right? Yes. Yeah. We might even see them in this game. <laughs> Where? Up. Uh, left. <laughs> Boom. Should we take anything off of it? Probably yeah. not. Maybe, uh... It's about to be dark. 
Okay, yeah, fuck it then. We don't want to get caught out. Did you hear that? Fuck it, I'm leaving. <laughs> yeah, I think that's just background noise, but I don't know. No, but I saw a wolf running away. Yeah, yeah, I, I thought I did too. I'm off at an angle again, so it's... Let me let me turn the screen for you, Dave. Okay. Oh, fuck, now I'm off at an angle and I can't see jack shit. Who's more no, important, Dave, huh? No, you're Who's not. It's directly straight at you. What? Yay. Oh, it's still scared because we killed the bud. Fuck you, Balto. I'm just kind of terrified now. Just, just generally terrified. Just, I know there's wolves around. I've seen two. Is that in, is that enclosed? Yeah. So it's going to be like the the lookout at the first. Right. So it'll make a it should make a pretty good place then. Yes. Although it'll be high up. Isn't that other place really cold? No, because it's uh, it's got it's insulative. And it's got a stove. Okay. Hmm. Come on, slow walking. <laughs> Man, we didn't pick up that much bullshit on the way here. No, no, not really. I mean, you know, 15 pieces of coal or some shit. That's nothing to sneeze at, especially if you're a poor guy. Or Canadian woman. Oh, that could kill me right there. I'm gonna do a once around. Yeah, make sure there's nothing sitting around. See, it's not instanced. Right. Oh damn, this looks bad. It's got a fireplace, I guess, and a bed. <coughs> huh? Want to break it down? Yeah, why not? Break it down. Uh, uh. Can't see shit. Hmm. Ah, fire animation, so peaceful. <sighs> so how you doing, dude? Pretty good. How, how are you doing? doing? Good? Yep. I'm, I'm relaxing by this fire. Relaxing by the fire. If that fire doesn't start, it's gonna be depressing. What, why? Because it's pretty much already going. Two hours enough, you think? Yeah, probably. Okay. So, we're sitting here. We're eating our uh, pork and beans that I just found on the side of the road. What do you think we're going to do next time, Dave? What are we close by? Well, <clears throat> we're close by some cabins. Um... I mean, eventually we're going to try to get down to one of the main houses, right? Yeah. Um, I'm heating up our tomato soup, too, and eating it. Okay. So, what we could do is uh, we'd go over here to the main town. Yeah. And we could uh, island hop over and uh, eventually wind up over at the waterfront cottages. And, uh, or, if, I'm sorry, this is the main town. So what we could do is we could go down to the waterfront, go this way, shortcut across. There was a rifle bullet under that chair I dismantled. Oh, cool. Go that way, shortcut across, and then, uh, go down here, and that'll take us towards the next area. Okay. Well... This wasn't bad for an episode back. 
What do you think? No, it's pretty good. Pretty good. You killed a wolf? Didn't even fuck up? Didn't get killed or nothing. Found a nice warm place to sleep? I mean, it feels like 90 degrees in here. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh. the air temp's only 55. We're just wearing extreme clothing. Right. Uh, let's drink some water and then we'll take a nap. We're still rolling around with two gallons of water, which is probably a bad idea. Take an actual night's rest. Man, I'm, about, I'm, I'm so excited to go see Ryan Reynolds talk to a camera. Two hours. Yeah, it's a good thing we've got equipment because it looks like it's turned to bad weather. A little bit. Okay, guys, we're going to... You know, I'll, I'll turn the lamp on while we do the farewell. Guys, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm the cooler one, Dylan. And my secondary, if not... I'm the cooler one, Tertiary person Dave. over here, Dave. The guy that can't not eat on camera. Um, next time, probably he'll probably have a burrito. That sounds, yeah. that sounds good, uh, Dave. No, I'm going to get... Right? Uh, I'm just going to get a bag of potato chips. Oh, yeah, really, really, yeah. really loud ones. Okay, guys, come back. Look forward to uh, Lawn Dark 12 and Dave's Chip Adventure. You know what else I'm going to get? I'm going to get some of those little 8-ounce cans of Sprite so that I have to open like a thousand of them during the... Uh... Oh, that sounds that sounds great. Yeah. Why don't we get a soda stream? You can just... I can just, I just carbonate it while I just... Yeah. just carbonate it straight in your mouth. Okay. All right, that's episode 11 brought to you by SodaStream.